Hello everyone and welcome! Darkside Phil here with a very special guest next to me. Marlon Brando? If that's your name, I always thought it was Leanna, but okay. Aw, I was hoping for Marlon Brando. Yeah, so Panda Lee, or Leanna, whichever you'd like to uh, to refer to her by, is we're here with me for a very special playthrough, ladies and gentlemen. It's the summer of 2015, it's some downtime, there's not a lot going on. And we've been looking for something interesting cooperatively to play. Uh, and not to say that this game that we're about to start is a cooperative game, but it's actually a game that people have asked me to play for quite some time. Uh, the Godfather, which uh, is not only one of the most popular American movies of all time, but actually a lot of people seem to really like this game when it was released for PlayStation 2 and the Xbox 360 and PlayStation 3. Well, completely ignore the book, why don't you? Well, the book obviously was the source material, but not many people have read the book. Most people have seen the, the movie. And this is a game, again, that for many years people wanted me to play, and I kind of veered away from it or didn't do it for whatever reason. And uh, now that we've got some downtime during the summer, we said hey, it's a perfect time for us to do an ongoing playthrough uh, and with co-op commentary. Even though it is a one-player game, I'm actually going to be uh, having Leanna join me for these sessions to add her cooperative uh, you know, take on everything that's going on in the game. The game supposedly plays kind of similar to Grand Theft Auto. Yeah. With a few variations, but for the most part, it's like a Grand Theft Auto-style game, which is cool. Yeah. And we actually just this week watched the movie, which is good because it's going to refresh us on everything that's going on. I love that movie. That is a good movie. Seriously, if you haven't seen it, if you're like one of the three people on this planet that hasn't seen it, <laughs> you should see it. And then you can also read the book. The book is really good. So, yeah, it's true that, you know, The Godfather kind of is a part of Americana, even though it actually has heavily Italian influence. The mobsters, mafioso, all that kind of stuff has always been a lot of a... Uh, the mythos of America, a part of the cultural heritage, and uh, this game was interesting that, they, that when they re re decided to do it and make it the kind of game that it was, okay? So, uh, so yeah, so we're going to try this out, and uh, looking forward to it. Uh, a lot of people don't know this, but I actually do have a strong Italian heritage. I don't. <laughs> in my family, yes, my, uh, the, the, the uh, maiden name of my family is Salvagno, and we come from Foggia, Italy. And uh, we had a long line of Italian heritage. It was actually my grandfather, who at a very young age came over to the United States as an immigrant. Uh, and, uh, you know, then, of course, married into all the American culture and all of that. And so my mom's side of the family has a lot of Italian influence. In fact, I, you know, I make an actual pretty authentic Italian sauce and, and meatballs and stuff like that. And that's all family done it's all in family recipe which is hilarious because we just watched the godfather and in the movie they're making a pot of italian sauce just like i do which is pretty damn funny <laughs> that it is it really is this this kind of authentic heritage from from italy and uh and i do i like the godfather i like all the gangster stuff gangster movies i love so, gangster uh, stuff that's like one of my <clears throat> favorite like because i don't typically like american history it's like a little too recent for me but mobsters like the gangsters that is like one of my favorite things about american slash a little bit of european history because it did really start in italy but a lot of them came to america and thus you know the things about vegas and new york i mean it is a part of our history there's many very famous gangsters in the american history so uh so yeah we're gonna get started just one quick thing if you're wondering why i'm playing this on xbox 360 so many people oh Phil, of all the versions to play, why are you playing on Xbox 360? It's very simple. Uh, it's the easiest thing for me to capture on. It's the most reliable thing to capture on for me. Uh, unlike, uh, unfortunately, I've been having some issues with my PlayStation 3 recently. And I don't know how much longer I'm going to be able to capture off of that thing. In addition, PS2, I have nothing that I can even use to capture PS2 right now. So, Xbox 360, easy, plug it in, it works, you know, no problems. And being that this is going to be an ongoing playthrough for the summer, and I know it's going to take a while... To beat it, I figured, hey, let's go ahead and do it on here uh, so that there's consistency and we don't have any kind of issues with it, okay? All right, ladies and gentlemen, so without further ado, the Godfather. I'll make you an offer you can't refuse. You didn't even do the you accent. play the game, the Godfather. You're Italian and you didn't even do the accent. See, I don't have any Italian. Whoa! Whoa! Uh... That was interesting. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell did you do? That was quite interesting. I've never seen that before in my life. It said there was a game update, so we're installing the game update. And now it's fine. Look at that. <laughs> oh, okay. That was wild. All right, here we go. It's loud, yeah. huh? You want my eardrums. 
Someday, and that day may never come. Wow, that's loud. I may call upon you to do a service for me. I'm gonna lower it a little Until bit. Until that day, accept this as a gift. Okay, this intro is different from the PS2 version. This is, of course, Marlon Brando's authentic voice. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Some of this actually is his authentic voice, but he was very sick when they did the voice recording originally, so only half of it ever got used, so I'm sure they, they bullshit some of it. I make you an offer you cannot refuse. Oh, well, here we go. Man. Damn, this game is loud. Holy this, shit. This is in New York City, 1936. So, mid-30s, the real start of the mob. Don Coyone. There we go. Wow. Here's a week's take. Nice. Good week, huh? Yeah, some high rollers. I'm gonna celebrate tonight. I'm taking Serafina to the Continental Club. Wow. Whoa, I'm having to wear lips. <laughs> hey, baby. That's fucked hey, up. Hey, baby, been using those lip stretchers? Aww. Nice. Where's my boy? <laughs> He's been playing handball. Been on the sucking on those fire hydrants lately. Nuts. My sister's looking. You're a jerk. Tonight, though. Good. Oh my god. Damn. What an explosive start. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Damn it, honey! You left the my toaster god. on again, didn't you? Oh, no. So All those good. cakes. Save the cakes. <laughs> the cannolis. Take the cannoli. <laughs> the cannoli. Go and get the cannoli. <laughs> leave the gun, take the cannolis. More like leave the bomb, take the cannolis. <laughs> Too bad about you, Whoa. Uh, okay. This is bad. Holy shit! Woo! What the hell? Did it just kill everyone? Yep. What the? Oh, they're alive. Who the right stick to attack? What the <laughs> flailing? <laughs> what is this? He's out of control. This is hilarious. Uh, uh, uh. I'm gonna teach you a lesson. I, I can't even hit him. It won't you work. have to redo the trigger. Oh my god. Do I, get my I didn't know I had to explain every little thing. I thought if you hold the trigger, it'll attack. There you no, go. No, it, it, it only <laughs> does it until you kill the person. This guy's amazing. Look, he's like fucking made of metal. Destroying everyone in this fucking alley. What the shit? Yeah, they knew you'd be playing the tutorial. Sorry, Tony. It's just business. Give it to him. Oh, I give him a hot stromboli. What? <laughs> That's horrible. Oh, oh, oh. oh, he got the, the sunny treatment right there. Damn. Poor bastard. That has to suck. God damn. No, sir, finish your cigar. You know, you just killed that man. Just finish your cigar. <laughs> they call that the Sicilian handshake. Ow. <laughs> yeah, you don't want to see the, the Sicilian Jimmy Tat. It's pretty Ugh. bad. <laughs> Look away. Look away. No, I am. Save your anger. Save it. When you are old enough, when the time is right, we will take your revenge. That's right. <laughs> and that's it. Oh. <laughs> uh, that, was a, that was a little immersion breaking. Whoa, oh, you get to make your character? Yep. Really? You get to completely customize your wow. character. Wow. You can make your character right, look as this. Italian or not Italian as you want. My god, look at how big of a jaw you can give them. Well, there are fat gangsters. There are skinny fa Oh, skinny. Oh, look at gangster. Giant forehead. Forehead feature? You only do two different settings. Light or dark forehead. Well, it puts definition in with, like, lines and stuff. To make our guy very defined. Oh, forehead mole. Nice. You get a left and a right mole. So you're matching moles. Look at that. Wow, this guy's very handsome with those moles. Ugh, Some blemishes. Everyone likes blemishes. Let's give him blemishes. Why can't you make a sexy Italian? Nice blemishes all over his face. Mm. 
The skin color. You gotta be very dark. <laughs> oh my god, how white can you make it? Oh! Oh look, it's you. With the whiteness. It's like fucking powder. From the 1990s. The freaking the albino. 1990s? Yeah, the movie from the 1990s. Powder. Oh my god. We can make him like super Mediterranean, dude. Well, you do know that Italians weren't always the dark, Ugh. the dark features that we know them as today. They used to be blonde. Here we go. Let's give him some hair, some greasy hair. Incredibly greasy. What's the greasiest hairstyle? Ah, there you go. Super. That's my hairstyle right there. Nice and greasy. This looks nothing like you, by oh, the wait. way. Both of these kind of similar to mine. This is me when I wet my hair. This is me when the the, the water ran yeah, out and it gets fluffy. Yeah, your hair isn't as fluffy up in the front. Better see up in the front because the hair length. Oh my god, look at this. This is a perm. Puffs up his hair. There we go, give him a perm. Why can't you make a sexy Italian? Come on, here we go. Look at that. That's a nice hair color. Uh, well, there goes my fantasy. Sideburn. Oh, we gotta give him Elvis sideburns. Yes. There you go. Uh, Elvis sideburns. Facial hair. The pencil mustache. They have a goatee in here. The Tom Selleck. The soul patch. There you go, look at that. Kind of looks like, ooh. Yeah, they have every kind of facial hair you can imagine. All right, I'll go for mine. What are they? they don't have to have a name for it. Those brows. His eyebrows are actually kind of close. Oh, there you go, look at that. This looks nothing like you, looks like just you like tried. Me. Look at this, yes. Oh my God. Uh, looks just like me, of course. Uh, there goes my sexy Italian fantasy. The eyes. What the? No spicy sausage for me. The, apparently the forehead is the eyes, okay. Well, no, if you tilt it to the side, obviously Whoa. you gotta keep moving the camera to see where the real definition is. You can make him look pissed off all the time, or you can make him be like he's surprised. Oh. Uh. This is great. Brow angle. Whoa! Now he looks like Satan. Now he's more mellow. He's more mellowed out now. Like him in between. There you go. Let's give him giant anime eyes. Ooh, he has a thyroid problem there. Or give him, oh, I'll give him squinty evil Italian eyes. There you go. Squinty eyes. Are Italians known for squinty eyes? Yes. Now he looks Asian. He does look Asian now. Look. No, he does not look Asian. He does not look Asian. What is wrong with you? There we go. Eye color. Ooh, what the hell? Those what are is green it? Eyes. That's green. It looks yes. yellow. It's really, it's a really bright green. It's, the color actually is, I think. Uh, we'll go with the authentic it. brown Italian. Cheeks and ears. Cheeks and ears, cheekbones. Is it affecting anything? Oh, the cheekbones stick out. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. It gets a, wild, a whiter face. Cheek shape. Basically, how much definition along the cheekbone. He kind of looks like my old roommate from uh, college. He was an Italian kid, too. Kind of does look like that. Were there a lot of Italians in Connecticut? Yeah, actually. Huh. Ear size, giant ears, giant dopey ears. See, in Pennsylvania, Italians were exotic. It was all like German people, so it's like no. when you saw an Italian, it was like, woohoo! Oh my god. We didn't know. Yes! Now we're talking. Oh god, that was a hideous nose. Jesus. The music is very exciting. Yeah, this is very dramatic music for character creation. Like, like in the middle of this, all of a sudden someone's gonna jump and like and shoot at you. A longer nose. You want a pug nose? There you go. Oh my god. I'll be somewhere in between. I should have been. The nose base. Creation. How do you do nose? What the hell's nose base? I don't know what that the means? Look, the oh, the width of the nostrils. Yeah. There we go. The nose tip. The nose bump! Oh god, the nose bump's awful. Especially if you have a broken nose. I dated a guy who had a broken nose and he yeah. had a huge nose bump because of it. He was also coincidentally Italian. Yeah. Ugh, a nice flat nostrils right there, I like that. Ugh. I should have been doing this, my god. There you go. Ugh. The mouth. Let's give him a giant mouth. A little mouth? In between, so that's, uh, right about there is good. All corner. Wow, there's a lot of freaking customization happening. Yeah, they were pretty intense with this. I don't know if they thought people were gonna make themselves or what, but I usually just went with the default. There you go. Like, he looks face. pissed off now. Look at his face. He's pissed. 
Ew. He's pissed all the time. Upper lip. Let's give him giant lips. Are you making fun of me now? No. Let's give him a giant upper lip and a tiny lower lip. How about that? I get the feeling you're somehow mocking me with this. He's got a, he's got a freaking over... Oh! oh! <laughs> He's like he's sucking on a lemon or something. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I guess we should Ugh. fix that. Yeah, please. Jesus Christ. What are you doing to this there poor we go. man? There we go. That's alright. A chin. What kind of Italian are you making? I don't know. Like Gre it, a very greasy he one. Extra greasy. He started Italian, but now I feel like he's become mixed with some horrible job this of the is, hut creature. This is the stereotypical Fagian. The Fagian mobster. The blemishes are just horrible. Ugh. Can we, like, get rid of those? They're horrible. I guess we'll, yeah, we'll take a look at that again. Now that we actually have a face that's kind of normal, maybe we'll... Kind of? What? What? That is not a normal face. Oh, look face. at that. He could have a no chin at all, or he can have, like, a chubby chin. I have a chubby chin. I give him a chubby chin. You there really, you go. Your chin doesn't have, like, any stick out, though. Mine sticks out a teeny bit. Mine actually, my chin actually does stick out, but it's hard to see when I have the, the goatee. That's true, you have the goatee. Mine sticks out tiny Chin bit. length? Make the, oh my god. Oh, he has like a big jaw now. Yes, give him a giant jaw. This isn't bad. This is actually looking pretty good. Uh, chin dimple? You can't see the dimple because of the, the facial hair. Yeah, hold on. Let's go back now. Let's get rid of the blemishes. I don't like yeah, the, the blemishes. Yeah, the blemishes are freaking me out a little. The blemishes don't work for me. There you go. How about that? That's good. Yeah. I prefer no blemishes, but that's me. He's making I lighter. He almost kind of looks like me a little bit now. The nose the is off. The hair's too but... long for it to really be you, but... Yeah? Yeah. Shorter hair? Yeah. That's your, about my skin tone. Your hair is, like, this one is almost like when you, yeah. when you like, wash your hair and you, like, blow dry it. Like that. Uh, a little it's not more, bad. one or two. That's as hard, low as it goes. Well, like one this. or two over. Yeah, there we go. That's not bad. It's, Actually, it's, it's not bad. It's not close, but it's not bad. It I mean. kind of looks like you. Yeah. Like if someone was blind going off a of basic description. The moles are kind of weird. I have a mole on the left-hand side of my head, not the right. Where? So I don't see it. Right here. That's like that's like the world's tiniest mole. So there you go. So that's there. Look at that. Oh, this you. is me. This is this is me. It actually does kind of look like you. Silvano from Faggia, Italy. Oh, mamma mia. All right, let's see oh, here. Oh, come on. Keep the shape at least. Give me something to work Oh, my on. God. What does this do? It changes your, like, you know, shoulder to hip oh, to okay. waist. You it know, buffs that. up. It makes you beefy. Size. Oh! No, we are not doing the Clemenza version. Let's do the skinny, super skinny. No. Oh, no, no. I'm in the middle. I'm right about... Right there, I think. Maybe you have to change the shape for it to really... Right here. That's good. Change the shape a little. I think that that's not quite you. You got a little more definition. Can't really tell because eh. there's clothes on. Yeah, it's kind of hard to tell. We could go with this. Yeah, let's just go with it. Alright, we'll go with this. It's close enough. Done. Enter the tailor shop? What is that? Uh, when you get money, you can buy fancy new clothes. Oh, okay. Alright, we'll just join the family. Aldo? No, 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 no. That, that is an Italian name, though. How do I go back? Uh, backspace. backspace. Yeah, there. Philip is not an Italian name. Where is the, ta the, the capitalization? X. Filippo! Uh, I am Filippo. That's not how you make a name Italian. Filippo. Okay. okay, fine. Or it could be Felipe. No, that that would be more Spanish, wouldn't I it? I am Filippo Salvagno. Everyone uh, calls me the Fee. Everyone calls me Philly Blunt. That's my my gang name. Uh, this is painful. All right. Price of loyalty. No Sicilian can refuse any request on his daughter's wedding day. That's right. And that is Don Vito Corleone, the godfather and head of the Corleone family. And that is some pretty damn good graphics. That's right. Nine years later, this is the... Ah, Connie Corleone's wedding, yes. Don Corleone. <laughs> I am oh, no, it's Luca. <laughs> ...that you have invited me to your home. Serafina. It's been too long since you've come around. I see you've had Let's your lips trouble. smoldered. Godfather. <laughs> She's older now, how dare you? Your lips have been shrunken. My husband was always loyal to you. He died for that loyalty. I 
have not forgotten him, nor the loss that you have suffered. Have you ever wanted for anything? Haven't I always taken good care of you? Padrino, forgive me. It's only that I'm so worried about my son. He's fallen in with some bad men. <laughs> Fools. He's in trouble and... One Directioners. Ugh. The worst kind of people. He needs your help. Godfather. That is horrible. After Zane left, that was it. He just lost his way. <laughs> uh, you know a little too much about One Direction. Yes. Thank you, Luca. My most valued friend. Don Corleone. <laughs> I'm gonna leave you now because I know that you are busy. Thank you. One more thing, my friend. I need you to find someone for me. Thank God that dialogue didn't take 20 minutes like it does in the movie. Just because you drove the fucking car? Uh-oh. I'm the leader of this So he's going to take care of the people who I killed, uh... Can. My f Oh, no, he's looking for me. I see. Yep, you're you're an adult now. You're probably, like, 10 years old in that, like, origin thing. Getting a shipping out of me. Ow. Oh, nice blood. My name is Luca Brasso. I've been looking for you. Huh? <laughs> Who the fuck are you again? This is the only video game I've been able to recreate my forehead mole. So this is actually a milestone in my gameplay well, ever. here's your first train mission and you skipped it. What happened? I was trying to read it and you were oh. got, you skipped it on me. I didn't me. even know you could read that. Oh, yes, wow. you can read. Oh my god. <laughs> I read the first one. <laughs> All right, while locked, move right stick up for quick attack. Power attacks, you hold it down. No, down then up. Down, okay. You flick it. And grab is both. You two, you just stay right there. You're gonna help me teach the kid how to look after himself. Okay, now, let's see what you got. Oh, you gotta hold it. Oh, 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 oh. Give him the balls. There you go. Not done yet. He's, he's dead. He's dead. I'm not done yet. You killed my god. You killed my father. Oh, fuck no, you. He didn't. Yes, he did. Fuck him. No, he didn't. For Salvano. The power of Salvano. Fuck you. Will you just grab him? What? He's not dead yet! Good. Stand him back up. Oh, you stand him back up. You can uh, throw them if you flick it to left or right and let go of the grab. I believe you can throw. Yep. <laughs> Bounce off the wall. Throw, try throwing him into like uh, things like boxes and stuff. You can drag him and walk him for a little bit before ah. you let go. Sometimes he'll let go. Fuck you! Yeah, try throwing him into boxes and shit like that one there. Oh yeah, there's an item in this one, look. Yep. Fuck you. Yeah, it's kind of a hidden thing. You wouldn't know unless you played the game. <laughs> money. He got fucking wrecked and a, a bag of money appeared behind him. <laughs> well, I'm assuming that's the loot from your, your gang stuff. You know the basics now. Oh, I can grab this? No, you can punch it. What the shit? You let me, you let this guy go to beat my ass. No, he warned you that Damn it, Luca. Go. Luca, you son of a bitch. You're working for the Turks, aren't you? I believe if you put him up against the wall while grabbing, you can slam him too, like up against the wall. Oh, they don't let you. Oh, well, the guy's nearly dead, dead anyway. So you and me. We Ooh, got, got some business. Come What's take this? a walk. What is that thing? Nothing. Random gas can. Kettle. Is it a gas can? I guess it's a gas can, just randomly there. How do I pick it up? You can't pick items up in this game, except Aww. for guns. I want a gas can. Can I punch? Oh my god! Damn! He's got fists of steel! He destroys fucking boxes with his bare hands. That's ridiculous. Wow. Alright, press Y in front of anyone. You'll need a map. Help you find your way around. Together with your notepad, you'll be able to find all the hardest spots in town. <laughs> I still forget where the hell I am from time to time. Minimap. Use the minimap to help you navigate to objectives, job locations, or businesses. Yep. Luca has marked your safe house. For more details, see the map in the pause menu. Okay. Your safe house is the green little house. Mission objective is always the So, very typical of these open world games. To the Corleone safe house. Oh. Uh, talk to him again, I believe. Oh, there never mind. Out of the way, Luca! Well, 
finish. What the shit? Oh, it's a Natalia. Yeah, well now he's dead. I'll show you what. Oh shit! Oh, he blew his face off. Damn. Yeah. What did you see that when he killed him? Like two birds flew out of his body or something. What the hell? Well, get in the car and get the fuck out of here. How do you get in a car? Triangle, I believe. Nope. First of all, there's no triangle. Whatever. Nah, you, know you can't what I mean. do it yet. Well, I played the PS2 version. No, you can get into a car. I know you can. I just don't know what the controls are different for the Xbox. This there one I could. Fly. I couldn't the other one. Maybe it's because of oh, Please don't. Oh, God. No music? No. They don't oh, play music in this game. You really? Should, you should be happy. There's no copyright there. I don't get copyright. Bullshit, I want old music. Well, I don't know if they changed it in this version, but I think in the PS2 version there wasn't a radio. I want some 1930s music! Well, check the controls! What is this? I think there's subtitles anyway that you can turn. Oh, that actually is true. I should see it. Look for subtitles. Audio. Aha! There you go. Nothing. Wow. I guess there is no radio. No yeah. music! Good. You don't need no music. This is despicable. That's it. I'm gonna get my own soundtrack. Uh, 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 you know you're beautiful. <laughs> you what the hell? It's, it's Look at a, this. It's a rival mob. What's going on? It's a big fight. It's the Corleone versus the Strachis. This is cool. For all help. Who's the bad guys? These guys here? Yeah, the guys in the opposite colors. You're in black. The okay. You're in black. The, there we go. The Road green. Rage Execution. Yeah, all the different families are in different colors. The Cuneos are red, the Strachis are purple, the Barzinis are green, and the Tatalis are yellow. What about the Salvanos? You're part of the black. The loyal Salvanos! You're, you're part of black. What's black? The Corleones are black. It's not fair. I want to be the Salvan. Oh my from god. Forge, yeah. I am in the safe house. Obviously, you could save and you hide out from families and the police, it says. That's interesting. Yep. What's in here? Nothing. Yeah, there's nothing on this floor. It's just... Any hot chicks? Hot chicks in the safe house? What's this? Grab? Use the phone. What, you do? what the hell? He broke the phone! He viciously punched it. No, it's because you grabbed a bottle and then you used the, the phone. You have neighbors, too, that you can uh, hang out cover. with. Wall cover. Look at this. Yeah, you can use this for later missions. And that's a back door. Back way out. Ah, and a car. Okay. I see. But, yeah... How do you save your game? Uh, you have to go to your room. What's the phone for? It doesn't do anything. It's for later. Oh my god. The phone's for it's, later. It's like dealing with a child right now. So impatient. What? You know what? Go to the neighbor's Oh, yeah, Italy! What's this? That's a health thing if you ever have health. Health? Good yeah. lord. Glowing drugs. I thought that the Corleones don't, didn't, didn't want to be in the drug trade. There's a giant it's nuclear a drugs it's here. A uh, Look at that. Yeah, well, you got a baseball bat. Yeah, how do I use it? You have it equipped, so now you can just... I think the, the aim and... I don't think you can do it in the safe yeah, house, though. Yeah, probably not, but... Oh, she saved my game. So impatient. want to do everything. Corleone! Nah! Save the game. In this empty slot. Very nice. 